This is the King Hitter Series 1 Rancher. It's an affordable entry level post driver. When the tractor is on site, it must be put into a park gear and the handbrake applied, making sure the tractor is safe when you leave it. Check that the feet are secure and stable on the ground. Then the freestanding leg can be removed. The purpose of this freestanding leg is so the post driver can be stored in the upright position. Next, check that the beam is vertical. This is adjusted using this turnbuckle, which can control the angle by 20 degrees to either side. The top link can adjust the beam 15 degrees forward and 20 degrees away from the cab. The Rancher is available with the option of a hydraulic top link and hydraulic angle adjustment. Now connect the post cap to the hammer by hooking on this chain. Then take the weight up. The post is now aligned under the hammer. The post cap has a small spike in the centre. As the cap is lowered onto the post, the spike and cap locates the post firmly in position. This also enables control of the post if it's being driven at angles away from the perpendicular. Disconnect the post cap from the weight and start hammering the post. The hammer weighs 205 kilograms, and because the post driver has its feet firmly planted on the ground, all the 75,000 pounds per square inch driving power impacts through into the post. Each hammering cycle takes 5 to 10 seconds, depending on the ground conditions. The rubber hose sitting on the top of the weight prevents the eye of the rope hitting the top pulley if it overruns the normal stopping point. This reduces wear on the wire rope. As the post is being driven in, it should be checked by eye or spirit level that it's going in perpendicular. Maintenance of the rancher is minimal. Just grease the main beam pivot pin. The eight pulleys have sealed bearings, so no greasing nor problems with dirt. The rancher is the basic model, suitable for farmers, ranchers, contractors, small landscape operators or anyone who has moderate amounts of post driving to do. It can be used on tractors from 45 horsepower to 100 horsepower. It's light, it's easy to hook up, it's easy to operate and easy to store.